If you are daydreaming about buying a spacious and affordable home in California, it might be easier to make it a reality in the Inland Empire. KCAL News reporter Nicole Comstock explains why so many people are packing up and moving there. If you get what you pay for, people in the Inland Empire are getting more square footage for a lot less money. That's why most people say they decided to make the move out east. The market's been pretty hot. Definitely uh, see the, the flow of traffic coming out this way. Anthony Rangel and his family were homeowners here before the IE was so popular. They've noticed pandemic era low mortgage rates, coupled with the new flexibility to work from home, had more people snapping up bigger homes in these communities. When the mortgage rates were low, that, that was a steal. If uh, you're a homeowner in the LA area coming out this way, you get a, get a bang for your buck out here, definitely. Um, there's a lot of uh, young families too that are moving out from a lot from the OC. Data from the U.S. Census Bureau and California Association of Realtors paints an interesting picture. Nearly 71% of people in the IE now own a home. That's up from 64% before the pandemic. Here's a look at why. The average home cost in Riverside and San Bernardino counties was $562,000 last year. That's $253,000 cheaper than the state average. Katherine Johnson is a local real estate agent. Buyers are moving here because of the walkability, school districts, and being able to buy a luxurious home anywhere from 1,200 square feet up to as large as you want. And the sellers are giving incentives. They're giving incentives such as um, buy down on your rate or incentives to help you with closing costs. That's for new bills. But the good news is there's a lot of new construction happening here. The IE also had 19% of the state's building permits for single family homes during the last four years. Yes, I'll be pro for development. You know, we have the airport, the malls, uh, we got a lot going on out here. For comparison, in the Los Angeles, Anaheim, and Long Beach metro area, a much smaller amount of people, about 48% are homeowners. Reporting in Chino, I'm Nicole Comstock, KCAL News.